The following contest is an Iron Man match. On the way to the ring, from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Candace Michelle. And the opponent, from Long Island, New York, Ashley. This sold out crowd is on its feet tonight here in St. Louis, Missouri. These fans are so excited, I'm having a hard time staying in my own seat myself. I'm with you on that, partner. We've got a great show here tonight for these St. Louis fans, and I can't wait to get started. Instead of pandering to the fans, you should really keep your head in the match. Come on, you're looking at a superstar who can beat off a crowd and use that energy to win the match. I think these superstars are going to keep it up until they've got literally nothing left to give. And there's the pin! One. Candace Michelle is a beautiful young woman, but I'm not sure she's cut out for a match like this. Are you blind? Look at her. You think it's a mistake to put her front? This could be three right here. One, two. There's the cover. One, two. This has been a great match so far, but I think it's pretty. Looks like somebody would rather play possum than fight. On the mat, shoulders down. One, this could two. be it. When I first heard about this match, I wasn't sure what to think, but these superstars are blowing me away. Really? As soon as I heard about it, I expected a tremendous matchup, and I haven't been disappointed. I didn't say I'm not disappointed, but I'll talk about getting stuck with you as a broadcast partner some other time. There's the reversal. I've seen matches won and lost because of moves like this. Man, this one's turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I gotta admit, it took me by surprise, and that doesn't happen often. That's an understatement. And here's the cover! One, two, three! 
The adrenaline is pumping. The crowd is coming alive. This is what they came to see. Hey, try to restrain yourself a little bit, okay? You're supposed to be calling this down the middle. He got away with it that time, but he can't fake his way to victory here tonight. Here's the pin. One, two. Looks like someone's moving up in the world. These superstars do everything they've got when they're in a match like this, but a lot of people don't realize what they sacrifice behind the scenes, too. No question. If you want to make it in the WWE, you've got to sacrifice just about everything for your career. It has to be as important to you as anything else in your life. And for a lot of guys, their WWE career, here's the band. This could be One, it. Two. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. That's the law of the jungle. An injured superstar is like a wounded animal. It's survival of the fittest. And that also... Here's a move that'll leave you singing soprano. And that ring rope is even less forgiving than it looks, folks. This is not a position you want to find yourself in. And that is just about the last place you want a ring rope. Just about? If you can think of a worse one, I'd like to hear it. Man, what a match. Kids, if you're watching this, don't try this stuff at home. Absolutely not. These are trained WWE superstars. And even they wind up seriously injured sometimes. That's for sure. Even me, a former WWE champion, has had his share of injuries over the years. Talk about superstars who don't have an ounce of quit between them. You're looking at them right here. And that's a potentially dangerous mindset to be in. If you're too proud to realize that you're in trouble, you might wind up risking your career for a single match. Hey, you got to be in there every single match and be willing to do whatever it takes. You'd know that if you actually ever step between those ropes. I don't have to have been in a match to realize that jeopardizing my future for the sake of one match is incredibly short-sighted. You know, I'm gonna replace you with somebody who actually knows what they're talking about. Maybe Carlito. He might be a little tough what? to understand sometimes, but at least he knows what it's like to wrestle a match. Man, I don't want this match to end. I'm with you, partner, but it's got to end sooner or later. Well, whichever way it goes, no Come one on. can say that these superstars didn't give it everything they got. Yeah, and 10,000 paying customers can't be wrong. Superstars have been given it everything they've got all night. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE Superstars One. comes into play. Yeah, you're not going to win a match if you're blown up two Dude. minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen match. This is just dumb. Three. You don't win a match by taunting your opponent to death. I disagree. Getting One. the crowd on your side can be a huge psychological boost. Two. Three. Four. Candace is not what you'd call a classically trained wrestler. Sometimes I wonder why she insists on competing in matches. Hey, this business is called sports entertainment for a reason, and I'm highly entertained every time I get to look at Candace in action. Watch 
watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. You know, if you let me train you, you could be cruiserweight champ inside a year. Oh, no. I've heard stories about the way you train people. You make Marine drill instructors look like pushovers. Are you surprised? They're just training people to go to war. I train them to be WWE superstars. Well, thanks, but no thanks, partner. I think I'll stick to announcing for now. This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. Yeah, the WWE fans aren't known for keeping their opinions to themselves. Look at these superstars go. It's obvious that they've done their homework on each other. That's for sure. This match might have been over by now if they had. 90% of a match is in the preparation. You got to come in ready for battle. It's so great seeing these superstars in competition here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't tell you how glad I am that it did. That's for sure. You know, anytime you throw these kind of combustible elements into a match, you're guaranteed a great show. And that's exactly what we're seeing here tonight. There's no doubt that Ashley is one of the most beautiful and talented divas on the roster. Her only problem is her terrible taste in men. You know she's... Re this superstar is all fired up! And so is this capacity crowd! Well, one mistake and we're gonna see that fire put out pronto. Even if you wind up winning a match like this, you're going to be feeling it for the next week. Yes, but that's the case if you lose as well. And having to deal with emotional as well as physical pain is that much worse. Hey, it's pretty insightful for a guy who's never wrestled a match in his life. Well, I've been in the locker room after a match and seen the superstars who don't get their hands raised. You can literally feel the disappointment radiating off them. It's not a pretty sight. Look at this, pandering to the crowd. Nothing wrong with keeping the paying customers happy while you build some momentum. Look at that, that's going to go over big with the fans and build some momentum at the same time. You gotta watch out for your opponent when they're getting fired up like this. Candace has got her work cut out for her tonight. Can she pull it off? Let's face it, Candace's athletic ability isn't exactly her greatest asset. Was that supposed to be some kind of a double entendre? Do you see a crown on my head? I'll leave the lame jokes to the Monday night crew. Oh man, these WWE fans are fired up. They sure are, and you know that's going to have an effect on this match. Anyone who thinks this business is a piece of shit should get into the ring with these superstars. I don't think anyone would last too long against them. These are trained WWE professionals. Ashley first came to the WWE as the winner of the Diva Search Contest, and it's not hard to see why. You'd have to be blind, deaf, and stupid not to. That is one beautiful creature right there. One, two, three. As 
as long as these superstars have got anything left in the tank, they'll keep going at it. They certainly don't look like they're going to give anything less than 100% here tonight. I don't think anyone in this match has even considered that they might not walk out the winner. Of course not. That's the kind of attitude that gets you beat quicker than anything. And that's something I don't think people realize. The mental conditioning of the WWE superstars is just as impressive as the physical conditioning. What a counter that was! It's crazy. I don't know what's more uncomfortable, watching this or experiencing it. Uh, experiencing it. Hands down. Trust me. Oh, boy. Somebody's voice just went up a couple of octaves right there. It hurts just watching it. I can't imagine how excruciating this must be. I think someone's been taking flying lessons. These superstars are on fire tonight. They sure are, and I don't think they're going to be put out anytime yeah. soon. It's only a matter of time before Candace Michelle tries to cheat in this match, and when she gets caught, She'll try to pretend that she's completely innocent. We've seen it before. Believe me, if there's one thing that Candace isn't, it's innocent. And I'm digging it. Why do I get the feeling it won't be long before you're working the word puppies into your repertoire? Whoa, I don't mind a little ribbon, but that was kind of a cheap shot, don't you think? These superstars are at the top of their game, but only one of them is going to have his hand raised at the end of this one. And that's a real shame because, like you said, this has been a great match so far. So what? You want to say that everybody wins so that nobody gets their feelings hurt? I never said that. I'm just saying that in a great match like this, everyone involved deserves credit for it. One, two... These superstars are so unpredictable. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. I don't think you're going to be able to just sit back One, and enjoy the two. ride. And what a wild ride it's been so far, with no signs of stopping anytime soon. Ashley certainly is a beautiful young woman. If I wasn't a happily married man, come on, what would you do with a woman like Ashley? I'm not going to answer that, partner. My wife might be watching. Two. I think we might be looking at the future of the WWE Two. in this ring tonight. Wouldn't surprise me one bit. This is a great match and the fans are definitely into it. And that's what really matters. If the WWE fans aren't happy, they'll let you know it. Night after night, the WWE superstars never fail to amaze the fans. And that's a good thing. I don't even like to think about where we'd be if they didn't. Well, we wouldn't be sitting here calling this match, that's for sure. Man, you just can't put anything over on these fans. You sure can. They see everything, and they'll let you know about it.
This capacity crowd is certainly getting its money's worth here tonight. And it's a good thing, too. If they're not buying tickets, we're not getting paychecks. Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about selling tickets the next time we come back here. Not after a match like this. I certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. No matter what call you make, you're going to get on the bad side of at least one superstar. And that's about the last place you want to be if you're not a superstar yourself. Trust me, I know. There's been a lot of blood, sweat, and tears shed in that ring over the years. And if these superstars have their way, there's going to be a lot more shed here tonight. This one's going to keep going until someone can't go anymore. And considering the conditioning of these athletes, that could be quite a while from now. Here's your winner, Ashley!